Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I will show you how to get the shake text effect in Wondershare Filmora. Again, it could be any version of Filmora. Maybe you are using the Filmora 9 at the moment or even the latest one, which is Filmora X. This will work with that. And eventually then once we have got that shake text effect, then you can pretty much use it over any video that you want. So without wasting any further ado, let's dive straight into the video. So that's the interface of Wondershare Filmora. Now, first of all, you need to have the text that you want to shake. Now, let's say, first of all, we will design a text quickly. So let's say I go with my titles and then you can go with any plain title that you want let's say i want to use this one so hold that and then drop it over your timeline once you have your text let's just quickly edit it out so i can put let's say the name of my channel here and pretty much you can just put anything you want based on your requirements and let's say so once you're happy with your text now this is how it would normally look like now what you need to do is just pause the video where you have the complete text in front of you. Now, what you need to do up here is, right now you can see that screenshot option here. So click on that and it will take a snapshot of that particular video. Go to your media folder and here you will be able to see the screenshot that you have just taken. Once you do that, it's here. Now keep one thing in mind during doing all these steps, you don't have to have any sort of video underneath or above this particular text because if you have any sort of video underneath it will not work so you need to make sure that it's completely empty there's nothing above or beyond or below this particular text next step is to have a video that you want to have this particular text on top of it so let's say i just choose this particular video for example that's the video that i have now if you normally play it out it will look something like this also once you have taken the snapshot of that we don't need this particular text anymore so you can just get rid of it and just have the snapshot on top of your video like this next step would be to go to the effects section now in the effects section click on included and then filters and the first option underneath filters you will see is shake now in the shake there's many of them we need to use the up down two, which is right here hold that down and then drop it on top of your snapshot like this and afterwards if you try playing out the video it will look something like this now And as you would see your text is shaking now that means you have that thing that you were looking for so this is pretty cool i would say especially in certain instances where you don't just want to have the plain text appearing in front of you once you have it it looks pretty funky and you can pretty much use in some of your videos that you're using for your youtube or any other platform that you're going to upload that it looks pretty cool so thank you so much for watching this video i hope you liked this video and also you got what you were looking for and you learned something new as well out of it if you did like this video do give that video a like just underneath this video also if you're new to this channel do consider subscribing because whenever the new videos are up which are every single week you would be getting notified about them instantly on your phones or on your laptops or wherever you're watching youtube with that i'm done with this video you guys have a great day stay safe and i will see you guys in the next video